Welcome back to another episode of Wakona Weekly. This week we have two new hosts, including Julie Kuiper and Devin Haley. Hello. Hello. This week we'll have another recount of Turkey Fest, which I will be covering. I have future events you'll have to keep an eye out for. I have a community spotlight on the Rotary Interact Club and a coat drive they are holding. And I'll be covering the updates on sports, and a special guest will be introducing you to some bloopers. Let's get into this week's news. This year's Wakona's Got Talent came together in another successful night as actors, musicians, dancers, video game experts, and some extreme sports students got on stage to perform for their peers and families. The night started out with me on stage performing a comedy act and ended with The Hub bringing back the Goofy Goobers in a show that captured the audience and had them laughing the rest of the night. Some of the show's highlights involved an array of songs like Moondust performed by Philip Bushy, Dress Up, which was an original by Ashton Bird, Can't Help Fallin' in Love by Amber Lockenwitz, City of Stars performed by Anthony Coviello and Grace Cacaviello, She Used to Be Mine performed by Liz Kruk, and others. There were two piano pieces done by Tim Therian and Sophie Gordon, who also performed a dance. Drew Dallas got on stage for his second Turkey Fest with another original rap called Peter Griffin, and the crowd even called for an encore. I want to take a moment to congratulate all of the participants, hosts, judges, actors, and the techies for getting onto the stage this Friday and putting on a wonderful show. Before we get into the upcoming events, we would like to briefly mention that Green Umbrella Club held a bake sale every day this week for the days that we had school at least in order to earn proceeds that will be donated to Teen Trees in order to help YouTuber Mr. Beast's efforts plant 20 million trees by the end of 2019. As for the events rapidly approaching, the Spring Musical is holding auditions on December 2nd with a dance workshop from 3 to 5, December 3rd with music and dance being taught, and December 4th and 5th with the final formal auditions. These last auditions will have you show off what you have learned as well as test your improvisational skills. The musical will be Once Upon a Mattress, so if that interests you, be sure to show up to all of the auditions, and if you have questions, send them to Mrs. Hoffman. And now, a little past due, but possibly still open, are positions for the CRA Little and Big Buddies program. They are looking for big buddies to help out with the program, and if you missed this opportunity, but still would like to help, try contacting Dan McMahon at the CRA. This week, we chose to give a community spotlight to the ever-busy Rotary Interact Club, which focuses on doing acts of community service. Three members of the group were kind enough to speak with us this week. Here's what they had to say. I'm here with Kate, Easton, and Kevin, three members of the Rotary Club here at Wakona, and I'm here to talk to them about their recent endeavors as a club. So my first question is, what is Rotary, and what do you aim to do as members of this club? Uh, so simply stated, I would say that Rotary is a community-based organization where we work together to try and better the community around us. So as part of your community service, what are some of the recent accomplishments or events that you guys put on? Well, um, we're very lucky to have um, quite a large membership as a club, so we try our best to get everyone involved so that we can make a big impact. So at some of our recent meetings, um, we've been assembling blankets and donating them to local homeless shelters. Um, we also had, um, back in October, we did um, a mini golf tournament to raise money for um, breast cancer research, which we donated $500 to Moments House, which was awesome. Also, this past weekend, we held a food drive at Stop and Shop, um, and as shoppers were going in, we handed them lists of donated items that they could purchase. So we received over 30 boxes of food donations, as well as 350 um, dollars and donations that we use to purchase gift cards. So that will be a big help for families in our community during the holiday season. So does the Rotary Club currently have any events that they're putting on that maybe people can help out with? Yeah, so actually we have a co-drive going on right now and we have boxes placed around the school where you can bring in old um, coats or hats or gloves that will be donated to people who need them and don't have the luxury of having newer coats and hats and gloves so we'll donate that to people around the community so for anyone who may be looking to join rotary club uh, how would they go about doing that that's actually uh, quite easy to join so every wednesday or every other wednesday we have meetings after school in the cafeteria where we talk about upcoming fundraisers so if anyone wants to join that hasn't been to a meeting they can just come to them anytime sign up and then they're in for future fundraisers so starting with Kate, um, as members of Rotary Club, do you guys have any uh, favorite experiences or events you'd like to talk about? I would say that my favorite experience has been making blankets throughout the years to donate to the homeless shelters just because 
it's something that you know you can do with your friends it only takes like 15 minutes but you know that it's making a big impact on someone else's life and it's something that we can do often and as a group I personally really like the mini golf tournament we do every October because we end up raising a lot of money for breast cancer and it's just really fun to go and play mini golf and compete against your friends and just it's a lot of fun Personally, I've had a lot of memorable experiences, but my favorite probably by far is sleeping in boxes on the CRA lawn. So by sleeping in boxes, we were raising awareness for homeless people around our community, and I just thought that was really fun to spend a night with your friends. So I'd like to thank you all for speaking with me today and representing Rotary Club. And for anyone out there who is interested, uh, as Kevin said, it's very easy to join Rotary Club, so keep an eye out for the next meeting. Rotary Interact is a prolific organization, which we hope sees continued success as they work to aid the community. Joining is quite simple, and we suggest that you look into the club if you want to make a difference in your area. We'd like to thank Kate, Easton, and Kevin for speaking with us this week. In sports news, in Wakona cheerleading, the cheerleaders all came together and competed at the Game Day State Championship recently. Here, they competed against 10 teams and came in second place. This second place position has awarded them the chance to compete in the National High School Cheerleading Championship, and it is there that we wish them the best of luck. Aside from that, there hasn't been much going on in terms of sports recently, however, there will be very soon. All the winter sports have begun their registering and tryout period. For example, winter cheerleading tryouts will be held December 2nd through the 5th from 4.45 to 7 in the Nessicus Cafeteria. You must show up every day and have registered on Family ID by the 27th of November. Likewise, you can register for all the other winter sports, such as women's and men's basketball, hockey, swimming, alpine ski, and Nordic ski through Family ID. If you have any questions, please be sure to contact Athletic Director Jared Shannon. Hey, it's me, Alex, the special guest. Thank you for watching this episode. That is all of our main segments this week. With it being Thanksgiving, we wanted to show our appreciation for all of you and continue our tradition of including a blooper and outtakes reel in this episode. We hope you enjoy laughing at our mistakes, and we hope you have an even better Thanksgiving. So, without further ado, here are those bloopers that we have promised. You guys ready for hair. a take? No, actually, because I just messed up my hair. It's okay. Thank you, sister. Okay, you ready? Everyone ready for a take? Ready when you are, Ryan. Right. <laughs> Intro. Take one, baby. <laughs> Banana! Alright. <laughs> uh, let's do one more read through, baby. <laughs> can't do that. You can't do that. Anymore. You can't do that. Lock me up and, and call me Jibbles. Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Wakona Weekly. This week I have for you some information and a recount of Turkey Fest. I have a spotlight on our very own football team with Coach Campbell. That he does. And I have the updates on the most recent sports updates. So let's get into this week's updates. <laughs> yeah, son. <laughs> <laughs> Start vomiting all over the table. <laughs> <laughs> all right. You guys ready for a take, baby? I believe so. I feel like I almost just died. <coughs> you may have. Uh, okay. Uh, record, outro, intro. <laughs> Do you have a question? My sweet kids. Thank That's you. not a question. <laughs> That's a comment. Mayonnaise is not an instrument. <laughs> That's true. In, in, intro. <laughs> Take one. <laughs> what was that? It's me getting ready. Sports and a special guest will be introducing this week's new this. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, are we good? <laughs> as long as I can actually read the words that are on the screen, that that'll that'll, that'll, that'll be helpful. Oh, is Devin here? Is De hey! Oh, okay. Not Ryan. I have five minutes. Devin, you have to do this very quickly. Yeah. Get in here. You have to. Are you hosting? Do you want to? Sure. Okay, get in here quickly. Yeah. Sure, she says, knowing she doesn't want to. Yeah, she does not want to host. Wait, should I say Julie Kuiper and Heaven Daily? Heaven. Take one, intro. Welcome back to another, okay. Take two, intro. Thank you so much. 
Take two. Well, thanks, Zach. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Hey, man, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Nailed it. Right. It only took three takes. Right, everyone get out of here except Aiden. No, no. Oh, yeah, there's no. Okay, yeah. There's no outro. All right. That's all for this week, folks. We hope you enjoyed our show. And if you'd like to. Nope. <laughs> I was doing okay. But we are proud that they worked of the put in, they've done this. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm ready. Can you do that? You'd be like, and on this episode of Welcome to Weekly, Max got a high honors, Mr. and Mrs. Boland. Thank you very much. Goodbye. <laughs> you like that, Charlie? Can you burp your ABCs? Oh, right. <laughs> it's like, I was like. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm heaving my ABCs. Okay, I'm ready. <laughs> Monkey. Every term, Wakona holds a trivia competition between hormones. Hormone. Between, <laughs> between hormones. Also coming up is a field trip to Costa Rica. In the past, stop it! <laughs> and in the unified. Wait. <laughs> in football, Wakona lost to Minishaw. Minishog? Yeah, Minishog. 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 Minishog? Minishog. Whatever one you prefer, if you get it wrong. Minishank. No. Wakona also defeated Northampton. Why can I not say that word? <laughs> Northampton. Hampton. All right. If I say it like 12 more times, it'll be fine. I'll burn your house down and I won't feel a thing. That's the greatest thing to accidentally overhear. <laughs> Damn it, Chris. I was so close. It's your fault. I'm blaming him. We <laughs> 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 Apollonian players <laughs> in the entirety. <laughs> You're welcome. This week, we chose to give the Intermune Mahim. Rotary Interact is a prolific organization which we hope continues to see success. Rotary Interact is a prolific organization which we hope continues to see success as a success. Two part of me. And although it's technically not sports, we also wanted to give a shout out to the Wakona quiz team for dominating. <laughs> oh, Lucas, get in here. Lucas. Oh, he's coming in. Oh, there he be. Ah, okay, let's do it. Take part, part two, take one, Ryan. Mike. Nick, do you want us to all use Ryan's no, mic? No, just mute yours. Just mute it, just mute yours, because I all worked for that. All right, Ryan's saying just mute it. Is that fine by you? You do our mics and just use uh. it. More. A little more. Yeah, baby. <laughs> this episode of Corn Weekly is brought to you by Minute Maid. <laughs> I, yes. <laughs> This Friday, this, this Friday, Friday, the, the annual, annual Wakona, Wakona Talent, Talent Show, show dubbed, dubbed, dubbed Turn, 
Turkey Fest, Turkey Fest was held by the by junior, junior class. class. Now, now, this year, this the, year theme the theme was a spin, was on, spin the on the hit show, show America's, America's Got, Got Talent, Talent where, where, in this, in this case, case, it was, was Wakona's Got, Got Talent. Talent. Tickets, Tickets were, were $7. $7. Per person, per person and the, and the show, show started, started at seven. seven. We, will we will cover, cover the, the show, show in greater, greater detail, detail next week. week. Yeah, I, yeah, don't, I don't, don't know. I just, I just simply read. 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 But, but we do we have do some have details, details regarding, regarding the acts. Yes. Our very Our own, own Chris Ross may have heard, heard of him. Heard of him. We'll open, we'll open with a comedy, comedy act. Act. and, uh, and uh, the local, the local school, school performer, performer Drew, Drew Dollar Bills, Dollar Bills will, display will display one of one his of works. works. <laughs> Crash, Crash Bird, Bird will sing an original, original, original song, song. <laughs> and, and there, there will be a, a band, band act, act and, and plenty, plenty of others, others as well. well. I did it. I I I did it, baby. I did it. I, I, I did it. Yeah. Yeah, I'm done. What does your pee look like, Troy? Well, like not healthy pee, like really unhealthy pee. It's brown. <laughs> Do you pee brown, Lucas? <laughs> no, but like, do <laughs> Uh, okay. Hold on a second. Okay. <laughs> Bananas. <laughs> Banana. <laughs> Can, you're gonna have to zoom out from my big large. Are you doing subtitles or something? Yeah. yeah. All right, Nick, come here. You're gonna have to zoom out. Here, someone has to zoom out for me. Zoom out? Yeah, because my I have a big peak of a brow. That's going in the next like three AM video. You added a jungle in the background. Wait, should I do a specialized background for all the characters? I could totally do that. I did it! Stop recording! I think I'm swell. Okay. Moderately funny for two year olds. Perfect. I'm two. <laughs> what tech stuff? Ryan, you don't know anything. Our pos uh, positions. Positions. Oh, for the CRA. Little big buddies. That's an oddly spelt name. Dan McMahon. Mayo. It's like that. Mick Mayon. What? Lucas segment, uh, part two, take one. <laughs> Can you do the unzoom? Thank you. Dude, it's an escalator. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot my bag upstairs. You better get it. What made Nick laugh? Breed. Okay. I'm coming for you. These winds, baby. <laughs> you know, Honor Society held its inductions for the newest chapter. <laughs> Why is he turning to like you know, the <laughs> chapter? <laughs> and Betsy Nichols and Joanne, you never added the last one. What is the last one? <laughs> Service and character. <laughs> there were about 40 new chapters. <laughs> we're just going to do wahs at the end of every take. Julie, sports take one. In sports news, in Wakona cheerleading, the cheerleaders all came together. Why am I ha Why do I have my hand up? Yeah. I never <laughs> thought I would be <laughs> announcing stuff about sports, but here we are. I don't know a Ryan voice. Can you do your Ryan story voice? Hey, this is me, Alex, the special guest. I like the Yeah, that's what I do. I'm like, I'm sorry. Hey, it's me, Alex, the special guest. No, you can stay. 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 
stay a while, have some fun. Hey, it's me, the special guest, Alex. That's not even how what it says. <laughs> no, 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 it's okay, it's okay, I can do it. I like it all in one. Sorry, sorry, Lucas. Let's just jump right into it. Haley Closure and Olivia Gambaroni of The Girl. What? Thank you, Nick. Haley Closure. No. <laughs> That's not funny, right? Okay, it's really hard to talk like this. In cross country, damn it. I'm, no. su I'm supposed to do Peach Voice. Yeah. yeah. Ten kills? <laughs> what the? That's what they're called. That's terrible. <laughs> Gabby Friedel skilled, killed four. People. <laughs> ah! <laughs> In volleyball. Zach, I believe in you. I know. Thanks, that. Ryan. Ryan believes in me. This one, this one's for you, Ryan. Zach, part two, take six. In volleyball on Sunday. It's Saturday. <laughs> Gabby Friedel killed, killed four. <laughs> <laughs> I wanna, we're, can we keep the sentence and just edit it? No, this looks terrible. Okay, literally, it's the Peach voice. I'm faster than this. And Brooklyn Calvert scored the other. You did say Brooklyn you Calvert. Did say Brooklyn. No, I actually yeah, didn't. You actually did. said no, I didn't. You did say Brooklyn. Go I, back. No, I was right. confused because no, you said right. a girl's name and then a boy's name for boys saw here. I was really confused. In that game, Halen Jamrog notably sent the game into overtime by scoring late. I did. Is Coach Campbell the best person we interviewed? He's pretty good. Yeah, he's pretty good about it. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Can we make the Gary list where it's like people we just have to interview? This has been Even John, no reason Lucas, and Aiden. This has been Donkey Kong, Wario, Waluigi, and Princess Peach bringing you Wakona Weekly. Come on! Yeah. 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 Okay. Thank you all for watching, and we hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did and you would like to stay updated, be sure to subscribe to the DC TV YouTube channel and smash that uh, bell. <laughs> <laughs> what are the like button? Oh, and the like button. <laughs> like it, please. <laughs> We also have various social medias that you can follow, such as Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And we have a link in the description that allows you to tell us about the things you want us to cover. Thanks again for watching. <laughs> <laughs>